Okay, so we got back on track and uh, both Dad and I are really enjoying uh, where we've gotten at Pilcher Park. Really nice, beautifully paved trail in between just a landscape of trees. Um, I didn't know what you were talking about earlier with the smell, but I do smell it now, and it's it's just nice and naturey and, and good and calm. It smells like spring. Spring. Uh, the trails are really confusing. There's trails that lead just out of the park and uh, to the next road, I guess. So. And we seem to be at one of those points now. So we're on the purple second trail. Second time we've been at a point like yeah. this. We're on the purple trail. So I wanted to say something about trail marking. If anybody's watching that is in charge of trail marking, what the, seems to be going on here is at trail junctions, they have color markings, which is nice to let you know that you're on a trail, but the problem is they don't give you, there's no information as to where to go. So the junction, of course, is a choice. If you're gonna mark a trail, you mark it down trail, but within eyesight. So each choice is clearly marked as to what choice you're making. Here yeah. we have a choice. Normally we're doing an outside loop. We're going clockwise, so we want to stay to the left. But we feel that this way where we just saw another hiker go is it probably like going to be like the last left, which was going to take us out of the park. Yeah, it, it looks like that is a pathway out of the park. And going right is a safe route so we're going to go that route because if it's wrong then what we've done is not done the outside loop we've done we've turned inward so at least we're going to be going toward the center of the clock but it'd be nice to know <laughs> yeah. give us a map or something i don't know well the ma the last junction was great it had a map yep and it had a, it had a trail post but it didn't give us the choices it gave us okay you're on one of three trails yeah but we didn't know which direction they were going that was a failure pretty big failure because the fourth route took you out of the park altogether <laughs> this is a cool view hey look at my shadow down there so that's what we got going on we're gonna we're gonna choose to go this way and hope for the best we saw a uh you spotted it. It was an old, burnt out. That's right. Or not burnt out, but rusted car frame. Shell of a car, yeah. That was kind of neat, just sort of tucked in the middle of the forest. So we had a talk about how somebody could get an old car to that point. How many years it would be? Well, how long would it take a car to get down to the rust points? And, uh,. Also, what was the tree structure? Because obviously now that car couldn't drive in. There's just too many smaller trees. So what? wonder what it, how it got there in the first place. This is pretty cool down here. All right. 